my name is Shaheen Perrette and this is my son. Hi, I'm Cameron. This is Cameron. And today we are going to show you how to do a lava lamp experiment. Um, so Cameron, do you want to go through the things that you will need for we the lava lamp We will need an empty bottle, some vegetable oil, vitamin C tablets, food colouring and some water. Right, I would suggest when you get started that you should have some sort of table mat because it can get a little bit messy. Um, myself and Cameron have done this once before and we had a great time but it was a little bit messy. Um, so, what do we need to do first? First, open the bottle. Open the bottle. So we've gone for a clear plastic bottle so we can see the experiment once it's completed. I'm going to hand Cameron the oil, be very careful. So we will need to fill over half the bottle. Oh, steady hand. Right. No children should be doing this by themselves. You must have a grown up with you when you're doing this. We've gone for vegetable oil. One, because it's cheaper than using something. I think that's enough. Um, cheaper than using um, olive oil. And um, we have lots of it in our cupboard. So Cameron's filled it over half. Over halfway. Now what do you have to do? Put water near the top. Oh, steady. Now we don't want to fill it right to the top, otherwise when we put our tablet in, it will overflow. A little bit more, do you think? Wonderful. Now, we've got an orange food colouring, because we did do this experiment earlier on this week, and I will show you what happened. Cameron, what happened with our experiment earlier on? We put yellow food orange food colouring in black food colouring and black took over. Yeah, black became the dominant colour in our lava lamp in our first experiment. So in our second one, we've decided to go for one colour, haven't we? Yes. Okay, so Cameron is now going to add the food colouring. This is where it can get a bit messy. So just be careful. Right, are you happy with that? Yes. Yeah? Okay, so as you can see, Cameron, can you describe what the bottle is looking like right the now? The bottle is yellow with some orange circles. Yeah. A bit like orange. There's like bubbles, isn't there, yeah. at the bottom? And you can see the water at the bottom too. So it's quite a nice colour tone difference here. So now Cameron has got to add the final touch to our experiment. So we have gone for a vitamin C tablet because it's a fizzy tablet. So let's see, can you manage? Yeah. So I'll get ready to put the lid on straight away and hopefully you should see an interesting chemical reaction. Don't suggest putting the whole thing in. So Cameron's going to go for... Are you just putting half? Are you going to put the whole thing in? Yeah. Go for it. And we'll quickly put the lid on and hopefully you can see our wonderful lava lamp coming to life. So this looks better than the black one, doesn't it? Yeah. Why, why, why do you think it's better? That looks bad. Should I put a tablet in that one to see? I think one there. Let's put this. Looks really dark, doesn't it? So, yeah. so I quite like the colour we've gone for. So, what colour food colouring have you gone for? Yellow. It says yellow. It says yeah. Orange. It does look orange. So I would suggest this experiment doesn't take very long. However, there's lots of lovely activities you can do around it. So maybe you could do a lovely piece of artwork. So maybe your young person could sketch the image that they see in front of them. Or maybe you could do some creative writing. So as an English teacher by trade, I would potentially look at sensory description. So you could look at what it looks like, the sound that the fizzing bubbles make. So that could be a really lovely activity. Or you could even do a lovely piece of poetry. So maybe in the form of an acrostic poem, you could write lava lamp at the side and your young people could then generate sentences of their own to then come up with their acrostic poem. So. I think this has been a huge success. Are you happy with this lava lamp? Yes, very happy. Yeah. So if you wanted to, you could keep this bottle as it is, and then when you wanted to reignite your bottle, you just add another fizzy um, vitamin C tablet. Thank you for watching. We hope you have a really good time doing your experiment with your lava lamp, and hopefully we'll see you again sometime soon. Please subscribe. <laughs> well, we don't need to do that as such, but thank you very much for watching. Good luck. Are you blue?